So let's talk about DWOC. Um, this is an upcoming catalyst. I'm sure you heard of it before. It's a pretty popular company. It's been pretty hyped up lately. Um, before I even invested in this company, or I should say swing traded this company or got into a swing trade on this company, I, I always saw value in this company. Uh, first off, this company is Digital World Accusation Corp. Uh, Trump, Donald Trump, uh, the president, what is the founder of this? Uh, it has a lot of hype behind the company. He obviously has a huge following. Um, a lot of his friends have a huge following. His whole community has a huge following and has a lot of hype and loyalty behind him. Therefore, like they, they support his company. Um, he has a lot of rich friends, so on and so forth. Uh, basically, he's a very experienced businessman, and obviously any business he gets into is bound to be successful. Uh, so first off, we'll break down the chart and the upcoming catalyst. So as you can see here, it's a recent recent runner. Um, means it spiked before in the past. It was about a year ago or a while back. Um, it had that huge spike. It has this upcoming catalyst for the launch of their app. Uh, Truth is the name of their, their app. It's going to launch on the App Store February 1st, which is this Tuesday. Um, so obvious Monday, it might have some hype to it. And then Tuesday when the catalyst comes out, uh, it should have a, a decent bit of hype behind it. So I'm already in the company. Um, I'm in fully on my swing trade. Uh, I day traded it a little bit during the swing trade, but mostly, uh, the last week I just held it out. Obviously the market's been re really volatile the last week, as you can see, Dow dropping 100 points and then recovering in the same day is just crazy. So um, with that being said, and the way it held a support right here and uh, didn't break below it at all and stayed pretty solid is a good sign. And with its recent history of spiking, it's also a good sign. But if we look right here, this is really interesting. This is where it gets interesting. With this small, slight little pullback in the market pulling back, and we can even look down here. This has this is a huge um, play for a potential sh uh, short squeeze. So it starts to sell off. Short starts selling it off. They might not be paying attention to the upcoming catalyst. Uh, the charts look like good for a short um, a short position. With it getting rejected up here and then selling off and then consolidating more. So they might be a potential sh uh, short squeeze candidate. And then if we even look right here. Um, Five short squeeze candidates to watch this week. And obviously, this is on here. Um, DWOC's on there. You can look more into it. And, and this is not me saying it's a, a short squeeze candidate. This is obviously Thinkorswim's news thinking. So analysts thinking it could be a potential sh short squeeze candidate, which is always a good sign. Because obviously, they probably know more what they're talking about. But if we look right here, this is something else I want to point out, which is a very bullish sign for any stock is this candlestick right here. See it has that long wick to it to the downside and it shows how strong of a um, how strong the bulls are in control and are able to pull it right back up even after it uh, sells off that much. So that shows that there's a lot of buying pressure over selling pressure in the bulls one. And obviously right here we have that pullback but we got to remember what the overall market was doing this week. That was so crazy. Never seen anything like that before. So we just got to keep that in mind. So right here could be the perfect setup. Another thing I want to point out that I saw in someone else's video was that this could be potentially be forming a massive cup and handle. Um, I don't really know where he, how, how he sees this, but basically people could be playing it as that or an ascending triangle pattern. So there's just a lot of different ways people are looking at this. Obviously, the overall catalyst on Tuesday, uh, everything like that. And with the price the way it is, and with it not being up that much, um, the, the news isn't really priced in yet. Not enough. And once the news gets priced in, and once the catalyst gets going, and then even after the catalyst, uh, it's going to be great for the company because... Obviously, they're launching an app. This is going to be like the next Facebook, Instagram, uh, any social media company. And obviously, that's the future and that's what's hot right now. So I can really see this running this week. I, I see it spiking huge like it did in the past.
because if we look over here, patterns tend to repeat themselves. They don't always have to. But this big spike right here is absolutely crazy. That all happened in, was it one day? One day to get to right here. Yeah, that was like one in two day, one to two days. It spiked up that much. What was that? Was that a hundred? Yeah, this thing spiked like three hundred percent. Was it three hundred percent? I don't know. Two hundred percent, three hundred percent. Doesn't really matter. It's a huge spike anyway. So, with that being said, uh, another thing to keep in mind. Last point. Uh, it tends to hold the fifty dollars support right here. Um, I don't see it pulling back to fifty dollars, but. Uh, never be afraid to lock in profits on this. Uh, always, like, say, for instance, the catalyst doesn't play out for some crazy reason. Make sure you have risk management in place just in case. And that's all for this video. Please drop a thumbs up so more people know about DWOC. Let me know your price target for DWOC in the comments down below. Uh, also, if you're getting in DWOC. And last point, what is the price target? I can see this definitely hitting it back up to its all-time highs. Uh, if it breaks that and has a technical breakout, that would be massive too, but it's still got a ways to go. Uh, like I said, we'll see how it plays out Monday, and then it will lead into Tuesday. But that's all for this video. Thanks for watching. Please make sure to drop a like and subscribe for more videos like this. Have a great day. Good luck with DWOC.